Well, how y'all are this afternoon? This is your buddy George Jones over at the Bergen Gun Range with my next installment on. Hey, I got this old used gun. The old used gun I got today is this guy. This is the X Cam Buffalo Scout. Now, the X Cam Company was a. Uh, oh, I don't know. It was the. Uh, this is X Cam Hialeah, Florida. This is uh, Verissa, Italy, uh, and it's Arami Tanglafalio, which is actually uh, manufactured for FIE and the XCAM Corporation, which is a subsidiary of, was a subsidiary of FIE. Uh, they manufactured these guns from about 1965. Uh, this gun was uh, under the X cam line, which is part of FIE, of course, firearms import export, um, and assembled in highly of Florida, manufactured in Italy, and assembled in Florida to get around the 1964 or six or something like that gun control restrictions on imported firearms. Uh, these guys are originally were about sixteen dollars. And when they quit putting them out on the market in the late 1970s, they had worked their way all up, all the way up probably to 49 and 59 dollars. It's just a plain, straightforward, 22 caliber cowboy style revolver. And they also had them in uh, 22 Magnum convertible cylinder, so forth like that. And we're going to take a minute or two and shoot this gun and see how it actually shoots. Uh, this come from the Kentucky State Police gun auction. <laughs> so we're going to try it here. It's already loaded up. 25 yards, 12 inch steel plate. I think I hit it. Yep, I hit it. Uh, steel chest center at 25 yards. Yep, that was a ding. That ought to be it. Yep. Half cocked, just like a Colt. Eject them out of there. And load that guy back right quick. And we shoot six more. And then we'll talk about it for a minute. I had one of these guns, I think mine was FIE Buffalo Scout back in the 70s when I used to trap a lot. Uh, my daddy signed for it. I used it on the trap line, used it on the uh, uh, trot line, sunk beer cans with it. Just a great little gun. For the money. Yep. 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 I think that's it. One more. I think that's it for sure. There we go. Make it on half cock. Check that six out of there. Pretty good old guns. It, it's a real statement for their Tang Falio's workmanship that uh, 50 years later, this gun still works. I don't know how many people have owned it over the years, but uh, this gun still works as agreed. The plastic grips being of the phenolic type plastic which is basically got um, resin and uh, uh, solvent in it the grips have shrunk over the years as the solvent has evaporated away it has a hammer block style safety on it that you simply rock over there like that and that blocks the hammer from the firing pin 
it has a free floating firing pin. The barrel is pinned in. The uh, firing pin is pinned in. It's basically a Colt single action frontier revolver, uh, probably made under license by Tang Folio because it is very, very similar to the Colt. Um, the estimated value of this gun today is probably somewhere around $100, $125. Uh, this gun came to me in a lot of guns that came from the Kentucky State Police gun auction where they sold, sell off confiscated firearms. And uh, overall, it's a pretty good old gun. Uh, don't have much money in it. It is pretty sure it's chromed instead of nickeled. Nickel is quite a bit more expensive to uh, process to do than uh, than uh, chrome is. It still retains all of its chrome where it's supposed to be. Uh, overall, it's a pretty good little old gun. You see one of these guns around at retail, you'd probably have to pay somewhere in this condition, somewhere around $125, maybe even $150. Uh, overall, it is a good, solid little Good solid little 22 caliber pistol. Uh, and there's not much more you can say about it than that. Well, that's it for my current installment on Hey, I got this old used gun. Uh, continue to like and share and subscribe and so forth. And uh, I just broke, uh, broke 500 on subscriptions. So uh, here pretty soon we plan to be giving away a... Uh, Plan to be giving away a Heritage Rough Rider 22 caliber revolver with Magnum Cylinder. Uh, and I'm looking forward to doing it. So, uh, we'll see y'all and have a good evening. We'll see you now.